Rumors surrounding the Samsung Galaxy Tab S9 tablet lineup have been coming in hot for months. With the Samsung Unpacked event kicking off in less than a week, we expect to get confirmation about everything we've heard so far. Unpacked should have some exciting announcements if you're a fan of the best Samsung tablets and best Android tablets. That said, the improvements coming to this year's Samsung slates should be worthwhile if you're new to Android tablets or the Samsung ecosystem. Let's see if the latest Tab S9 Ultra is a worthy upgrade over the Tab S8 Ultra. In terms of design, it seems the Tab S9 tablets will retain the same basic form as the Tab S8 line. According to OnLeaks, the Tab S9 Plus will be of a similar size to the Tab S8 Plus. The new tablet will recreate the Tab S8 Plus stealth design, including its slim bezels and matte aluminum chassis. We don't see the magnetic strip in the Tab S8 heads in these renders, so Samsung is either planning on removing it or the render simply doesn't show it. Like its predecessor, the Tab S9 Ultra looks sleek with its notched display, at least according to those leaked images. We expect the new Ultra to once again feature a large 14.6-inch old display. The Tab S9 Plus should feature a 12.4-inch old display with a 120Hz refresh rate. Its dimensions should also carry over from the Tab S8 Plus. One interesting bit is how the groove for the S Pen on the back looks to be further apart from the cameras, which drops the pill-shaped module of the Tab S8 Plus in favor of two separate cameras. Better dust and water protection are also rumored for Samsung's upcoming tablets. For instance, the Tab S9 Plus will allegedly have a respectable IP698 waterproof rating, which could make it more durable than its predecessor. Now, display analyst Rashion tweeted that the entry-level Galaxy Tab S9 will pack an OLED display. While the 11-inch Tab S8 was LCD, Galaxy Tab S9 will be old. Will help boost the old tablet market. The Galaxy Tab S6 had an old panel. But since then, Samsung has reserved the display technology for premium models of the Tab S7 and Tab S8 series. Entry-level versions of those tablets featured LCD screens. If Ross is correct, all three expected Galaxy Tab S9 tablets would have old panels. Now it sounds as if the Tab S9 cameras will be similar to those found on the Galaxy S23 and the S23 Ultra. That being the case, we can guess that the Tab S9 Plus will come with the upgraded cameras seen on two of the best Android phones. The Galaxy S23 cameras feature a 50 megapixels main camera augmented by a 12 megapixels ultra-wide shooter and a 10 megapixels telephoto lens. We don't expect the Tab S9 or S9 Plus to have a telephoto camera. If they did, it'd be a huge upgrade from the 13 and 6 megapixels ultra-wide cameras the Tab S8 Plus packs. According to leaks, the Tab S9 lineup will use the Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 chip seen in the Galaxy S23. That chipset offers impressive flagship-grade performance and we'd expect the same for the Tab S9, only with the potential for better heat dispersion. That in turn would improve the tablet's performance. Another leaker, Rivegnus, tweeted that the Tab S9 Ultra will have a 10,880 mAh battery, which would be smaller than the Tab S8 Ultra's 11,220 mAh battery. As for the entry-level, Tab S9 will pack an 8500 instead of the 8000 mAh of its predecessor. Another aspect that's rolling over to the new models is 45 watts fast charging, according to the listings. Everything we learned here is based on alleged leaks and rumors. Because of that, it's wise to retain some skepticism about any Galaxy Tab S9 claims until Samsung officially reveals the tablets. That said, if rumors are accurate, the Galaxy Tab S9 tablets won't be revolutionary. We expect the same basic design as their current-gen counterparts. At least the small updates seem worthwhile, especially for those who have an older Tab S7 tablet. If you want a Tab S8 tablet, though, you might not need to upgrade to the newer models. Of the three Tab S9 slates, the entry-level Tab S9 is reportedly getting the most upgrades, highlighted by the new old panel and better rear cameras. All the tablets will apparently pack a Snapdragon 8 Gen 2 processor, which should offer noticeable performance boosts over the current-gen models. The July 26 Samsung Unpacked is almost here, so we'll hopefully get official word on what the Samsung Galaxy Tab S9 series has to offer. So what do you guys think about these upcoming tablets from Samsung? Do you think it's a profitable upgrade over last-gen tablets? Let us know your valuable thoughts below in the comments section, and I'll see you guys in the next one. See you for the next time. Peace out.